dining is on hold indefinitely in Philadelphia due to the pandemic. So struggling restaurants are turning to outdoor dining as a solution. Alexander Hoff has more on one alfresco event. Some think would be a good idea to keep around. The vibe this Saturday here on 2nd Street in Northern Liberties will not be that of a street festival. Instead, an expanded outdoor dining experience with an emphasis on social distancing. Reservations, well, they are recommended. The urban landscape of Philadelphia has taken on a new look. I think it's personally great, especially for the atmosphere. Dining on sidewalks where seating wasn't available before and in previously occupied parking spaces are the byproducts of necessity and have given rise to a new term. A lot of restaurants that have already set up streeteries and they're going to be operating those streeteries. These streeteries will be expanded this Saturday from noon to 8 as 2nd Street in Northern Liberties is shut down to vehicular traffic. We have two barricades, one at the cross street and one at 2nd Street. Called Easy Streets, the meandering of past open streets events will be replaced by reservations for sit down meals. Our hope is that it offers an opportunity for um, our restaurants to be a little bit more busy throughout a longer period of the day um, and have more consistent business for a day. East Passyunk Avenue had planned on hosting a similar event this weekend called Open on the Ave, but that has been canceled and is pending a new date. It can only get better, it can only help the area, it can only help the restaurants. Set in Northern Liberties opened up just two weeks ago. They say the ability to move their business even further into the street this weekend could give them the boost that they need. People don't really know that we're here yet. As we said before, it's a brand new joint, so we're trying to get a little bit of exposure, trying to get people to come and try the food. Now, we have heard from lots of people who would like to to see some of these changes made more semi-permanent, if you will. Now, parking spots are one thing, but we are told that closing down an entire street, it is a complicated and expensive process. Reporting in Northern Liberties, Alexander Rehoff, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.